So anytime we increase fees, it's a great concern, and, uh, and we, we always hesitate to do this unless it's absolutely necessary, but the president felt that this was a time when we had to protect the education of our students. Uh, we've had increasing costs, and we want to make certain that we have classrooms available for students and that they can graduate on time and get the kind of quality education they expect by being at UCLA. In, in order to keep uh, UCLA healthy and, and thriving, uh, obviously uh, that we have to continually invest in. And uh, the student increase in fees is part of that investment, but there are other activities going on as well. We be, made a real effort to become more efficient administratively, academically. We're looking for increased fundraising and looking at other sources of revenue. So it's really a partnership and, and many different different areas of the campus are going to contribute to make sure that we can keep uh, UCLA excellent and, and vibrant. So any increase, of course, we're concerned about, and although this one's around, I think, $800, for, for many families, for many students working, it's still a challenge. So we are concerned, but uh, fortunately, financial aid takes care of many of the, the needier students, so uh, that's reassuring. Uh, you know, there was a good deal of activity outside this building. I think it was very unfortunate. I know that several policemen were actually injured, so this is really terrible. I'm proud to say, however, that I believe UCLA students were in the building, uh, making their voices heard uh, peacefully uh, in the meeting, and I'm really proud of them. I think they, they were in the right venue at the right time, and uh, it's great to see UCLA students expressing their opinions, uh, but doing it peacefully and appropriately.